hello hello guys welcome back to the channel so we had some news from Microsoft this week so on Monday they had they announced that Intune now supports Ubuntu 24.04 LTS so let's see we can if we can get this done in this video so I have some stuff prepared here already so I have my Ubuntu machine where I will log in here let's see where is the version terminal uh, release minus a so we have here Ubuntu 2404 LTS so we are gonna try this out because I heard that uh, in the past it was like a pain a pain in that place to enroll some Linux devices so let's try this out today so let's see if we have some packages that should be updated first of all probably we had a lot of package oh my god two three four packages <laughs> let's try just okay 231 packages let's see oh my god i should do this before the, the start of this video right but le let's try to do everything together so yes oh, it's very fast i hope that it doesn't take so long to install all the upgrades Just open the intern portal here just to show that we have zero Linux device here, we have no policies, nothing configured yet. So yeah. On this video the, the the goal is just to enroll the device. So afterwards we can try uh, some compliance policy. I know that we cannot do too much yet. But yeah, if you get this thing done, maybe we can do, we can try some scripts afterwards or compliance policies. So we had our packages upgraded. So let me open Firefox here. And I'm gonna type uh, in tune Linux enrollment let's see no no so yes how can we enroll what are the prerequisites for this so install these apps prior to enrollment so first of all we have to install edge and then we have to install the Intune -in app after this we have to sign in that's it so let me just install edge first here microsoft.com slash edge okay okay done so let's install this thing via terminal to install Microsoft Edge okay let's see okay Microsoft Edge is here 
So what is next? Then we need an Intune app. Let's go. Oh man, I should change the <laughs> the screen resolution, but let let's go like this. So first of all, here are the requirements. My machine is this one, so we are good to go. Curl, let's install curl first. When you will installed. Okay. First step done. Install the Microsoft package signing key. Let's go. Okay. Now this is for 2204, 2004. Install the Intune app. We will do sudo update and then sudo install Intune portal. Okay. Here we go. So what's next? Okay, this is related to the update. Okay, reboot your device. So let's reboot my device. First of all, let me check if we have something to update. Ah, okay, yeah, we got three packages to update. Upgrade. Okay, so I'm gonna copy and paste those packages so this is python and you're going to release upgrader let's go okay let's see if we have the okay we have the intune app we have microsoft edge let me go back here so the enrollment process open intune app Okay, first let's restart this machine because <laughs> it's requested, right? Restart. Okay, here we go again. So I have Microsoft Intune. I will just open this and try to sign in. Hmm. Authentication required. Now my password. Okay, Authenticator app, very important. Okay, it looks good. Help us to keep your device secure. So let's start the registration process. Set up ac access. Set up your device to access email, Wi Fi devices, and apps for your organization. Begin. So, what can my organization see or do, uh, or do when I enroll my device? View model, serial number, okay. I accept Microsoft. Oh, cool. Registering you already? Very fast. And it's already compliant because <laughs> I don't have any compliance policy yet. But okay. Very, very fast. And 
then this is my machine name CL Ubuntu then let me go back to Microsoft Intune and just refresh this okay not yet a few moments later if oh see here we go our machine here enrolled with the uh, OS version 2404 and yeah this is a virtual machine a virtual machine and I don't have like anything configured here so what can we see here okay very simple and what can we do for Linux just the compliance and some scripts yeah it's it's a start I mean when they announced uh, the support for macOS, so the start was very hard. So, but now I they have a, like a good foundation for macOS. So, but now you can enroll your Ubuntu twenty four zero four on intern. So, see if you if you follow like exactly the those steps here. So you can get this done like in five minutes or less. It depends. So and then let me show this again. Probably we have another. Okay, yeah, yeah. Twenty four zero one LTS after the the upgrade. Yeah. Thank you for watching. And if you have some doubts, just comment below. Enjoy your day.